Okay, welcome to the first tutorial for Adobe Photoshop. This is a picture I have made now um, with uh, the use of layers and layer blending options and and stuff like that. We're going to make a new picture. Just go to File and New. Make it a uh, make a new picture with a width of 400 and a height of 200 click OK and just maximize this picture now go and go to click the gradient tool and just go up here and make you can go to the gradient tool and go up here and click this to make a new pattern to make there we just click new if you want to make your own here, here you will see you have on the top here all these points you can click wherever you want here to make a new opacity point on the top these are the visibility opacity and on the bottom is the is a fading of all the colors and stuff so we are going to let's see let's make it in one in the middle let's have it dark red something like that make this hmm. ok save it XD Woo ok and just make just make a Make whatever something like that. That's nice. Okay, when you made your gradient, click, uh, hold down Shift and Control and click N to make a new layer. You can also click this button here, which says Create New Layer, or you can go to Layer here and New and Layer. So, no matter what you do, you'll come to this this dialog box here. You can you can make it a mode, you can make it a overlay, a light and color dodge, a multiply, a dark and dissolve, anything. Now we're just going to leave it as normal. Have it a opacity of hundred and write just leaves. Okay. And uh, Go to the brush tool and uh, right click and you'll have these options here, go to the bottom and you can use whatever you want, you can use this one, this one, you can use stars, you can use leaves here, you can use yeah, and just whatever you want to. Let's try to make a one with grass here, just paint some grass. Some grass here. Let's just do like this. Okay, and right click and go to leaves. Just click some somewhere around. That's nice. Now we'll right click and choose. Actually, we're going to make a new layer for these leaves. Let's go here and go to layer properties for leaves and write grass. Just they have a green color, so we know. Okay, uh, just make a new layer. Write falling leaves. Just right click and go to. Sorry, okay. Uh, let's make just some leaves here. Just click some somewhere random here. Okay, that's nice. Now you can see you have first the background, then the grass, and then the falling leaves. Go to the falling leaves and go blending options. Turn on drop shadow, inner shadow. Ah, let's just have a drop shadow. Let's have a distance of uh, 18, maybe. Yeah, let's just have it. 
then go down to pattern only let it leave that as normal and use well I think this one is very nice use that one as layer layer pattern overlay scale down as to around 30 in scale just Then have a blend mode to luminosity, so it affects like a cool way. So I will see it has shadow to the to the background here, and um, let's just. Let's go to the grass, right click and go to blending options and make the drop shadow of around 8, maybe 10. Okay, let's, let's see. Looks nice. Let's have it a texture. Let's drop that bell and I will go down to pattern overlay and let it have a a luminosity luminosity blend mode and a scale of uh, thirty maybe twenty seven maybe twenty five seventeen that's maybe nice just use the same let's try to use I like that one. Okay, let's try to use this one. Let's have it 40, maybe. 40. Click OK, and you'll see now the folding, the background, the grass, and the folding leaves. Let's now make a. a a text on this we're going to go to click the you have to click the text button here make a new new text here just write whatever you want to Adobe Photoshop for example and let's see let's just make make it here let's have a white color Maybe a light, a light green color. Maybe light yellow. Maybe that looks nice. Mm. Black. I think black is quite nice in this case. It's got a um, lighten up. So okay, this is going to show up really. Okay. When we have the text here, let's make it the top of just maybe around here or something. Now you'll see you need to place the background at the bottom, which is which can't be anywhere else, so it's just stupid said. Actually you can unlock this, I think. There. If you convert it to a small layer, you can actually move it. <laughs> okay. Anyways, you'll see the background, the grass. Then it comes Adobe Photoshop logo and the falling leaves on top of that again. 